guys, this is Kevin out of Onyx. Today we're going to briefly touch on uh, an item that maybe some of you do not think about is your trigger system. A lot of factory firearms have triggers that are kind of eh and uh, definitely can be inconsistent is uh, one thing today is uh, I'm going to show you a Smith & Wesson Pro Series. It's got an upgraded trigger system versus uh, M&P with a factory trigger system. I've shot this firearm before. It's uh, not really that consistent it, it honestly kind of feels a little grindy like sandpaper or something in it uh, we've looked at the trigger <laughs> the best we can and uh, it's just bottom line a factory trigger and we're going to show you maybe the difference between an upgraded trigger and a factory trigger gary's a, uh, an excellent shot i have no doubt that uh, what he aims for he's going to hit but the trigger is going to come into play with this trigger pull it's going to either make him pull left pull right pull up pull down uh, but if you're out training and your trigger is not nice and smooth in your firearm and if you're pulling shots one way or the other, it may not be you. It may be the inconsistency uh, that's forcing your finger to not do the job that it's supposed to do or what you're used to doing or what you're training to do. So here we go. I'm going to take five shots. Gary's going to take five shots. We're going to examine the situation. Here we go. So once again, I'm shooting the Pro Series with an upgraded trigger package. So basically, hit four bullseye groupings in uh, one group. I pulled off a little bit uh, to the bottom on this one. Gary, why don't you go ahead and take a shot and let's kind of examine what you're doing here. So you got two nice clean shots in the front end, pulled three left and bottom on that. What do you think, Gary? Yeah, it was just a uh, little grindy, hooked it up, pulled a little more. Yeah, it just kind of forces your finger in, yeah. in a little bit different direction, doesn't it? Used to a smooth trigger. You exactly. So uh, the point I'm trying to make is a trigger upgrade is something that's very affordable. And if you're wanting to train, if you're going to the range and you're punching bullseyes all day, great, more power to you. But if you find that you're you know, hitting a couple good bullseyes and you're pulling left, pulling right, but you're studying your form and you can't figure out what you're doing wrong, maybe start looking at your trigger system. So uh, anyway, hope this helps. Everyone have a good day.